Charmaine here with another thermal printer unboxing. In this video, I will show you how I used this cute bear label printer from IMO Printer. If you want to see how I used this printer in like a journal or crafty context, I have a journal with me video. It is available. I will put the link in the description. But in this video, I will show you how I used it in a more functional way, which is to create labels for my embellishment organizer pill case system thing, as you can see on screen. Of course, we begin with an unboxing and I'm just gonna turn on the ASMR thing here. So this printer came from IMO. They sent this to me and this is gifted. So I didn't pay anything for this. So thanks IMO and also they sent me this D30S Smart Mini Label Printer and it came with these three different label stickers. So they have a continuous one and they have one that comes in like little patterns. I will discuss this in detail later on but for now if you like what you're seeing so far do take the time to click subscribe turn on notifications and give this video a thumbs up so let's go unbox the printer itself when you open your printer you get the cute little unit with the teddy bear on it they actually they actually have it in this white color and a brown color it comes with a usb cord for charging and also your manual as well so the mouth of the cord is a type b and it connects to a usb for charging so this is the body of the printer apart from the cute little bear that i can't stop talking about you have your power button at the bottom you have your lock on the top you basically pull and or pull or push wherever you're holding it from to unlock it and you can see where you put in the label sticker cartridge the charging port is at the bottom so you just plug it in there when you want to charge it so the sticker cartridges come in different designs for example this one is the brown bear detail with a continuous paper so it's basically a sticker cartridge a sticker roll cartridge that is continuous and does not cut compared to the other rolls that are patterned and basically they're just like little small sheets and they have like fixed length you can buy them in the plain labels or you could also have them in these pre-made sticker labels with cartoon details now let's set it up and you will need to download the print master app i'm using the blank pattern paper and it's 12 by 20 mm and it fits my pill cases well and just about the right size so just load the roll in the cartridge compartment so this is a bit tricky at first but once you get the hang of it it should be fine and just pull the edge of the sticker roll onto the roller it is a bit tricky when you're printing for the first time i actually had a couple of mistakes but the thing is you have to connect the unit to the app and the app will identify the type of rule that you've loaded onto the cartridge and once it's connected it'll take a while it'll try to identify the roll that you loaded but when it does it will automatically give you the setting that you need according to the manual it should automatically adjust the positioning of the sticker label but in my experience the first print is always like hit and miss but after the first print it's sort of like already knows and it self-corrects so the next couple of prints will already be like perfect so as you can see i'm just printing a couple of the labels so there are a lot of features in this app you can change the font you can change the sizes you won't also have the positioning issue if you're using the continuous roll but actually once you've already set the whole thing everything else is straightforward you just change the font you just change the text you just change anything on the screen 
and here we go my finished labels here are a couple of my test prints for this batch of labels so i tried the smaller fonts i tried the bigger fonts the next part of this video is very straightforward i'm just going to be labeling these pill cases that i use to organize my embellishments so i have a couple of embellishments right here if you're wondering what i use them for sometimes i use them for mail but most of the stuff in this embellishment cases are for my handmade paper making and i find the size just perfect to hold your different little doodads sometimes you can't really keep track of the small bits and pieces and i find that putting them in this bookcase is easier for when i'm trying to organize things also let me share with you a tip sometimes when i switch roles the app doesn't automatically identify the shift in the role or the change in the role so what i do is i connect and disconnect the unit from the app I just turn it on and off and it should be fine and that's basically it a very straightforward tutorial i've actually been labeling a lot of things around the studio using this printer because one of the things that i like about this label printer is that it prints super fast there is like zero second wait time so yes my personal opinion is that there is a bit of setting up when you're using the patterned paper not the continuous one like the positioning of the sticker but once you get through the first ones after that everything else is super easy and you can just print as many labels as you want anyway guys i will put all the relevant links in the description if you want to purchase one of these and that's pretty much it thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you in the next one enjoy your weekend